but he spent all his time trying to rally and create leadership and commitment to society for all. So therefore, this is why I look into you, that you are the same caliber. You can make changes, and that you would make things that wing holy incidents will not happen again because we are together, we are united, we won't allow this unfairness to be done to the Asian American because of you, because of this program. Over 30 some cities, uh, so many groups and 120 participants. These three days, we went through a lot of soul searching, learning, and also connecting. And I hope that this is just the beginning. So it is an unfinished journey for us to fly together towards a better ground in civic engagement. How important it is for you to make sure that we're heard? Because if we don't speak up, I think people do assume oftentimes that Asians are really quiet, Asians are really meek, they don't unite, and they don't work together. And that's where I think that that rhetoric is, is something that I'm very proud to be able to change. From 40,000 to 2,000, we, uh, we have to improve. That's why we are civic engagement is so important uh, for our future. Leadership training is most important uh, for the students uh, when they was uh, young and uh, we, they need to be trained very well. The, the best way to achieve the goal is by talking to people and then to write down you know ways the best practice take them home and then implement them step by step from uh, our sense of volunteerism uh, from individual to collective or organizational involvement then it's important that it goes through the electoral uh, process you know of being involved Politically, without civic engagement, we can never achieve uh, political empowerment, and without political empowerment, we can never really, uh, really further the agenda of our community. Well, that's one example in my life, right? Another one is all males are toxic. Are males toxic? Well, yes, but not all. Not all, right? But how do we redeem that? So that's my whole journey I'm sharing with them. young people and current members of the working public as well. I'm really interested in um, getting to learn how I can positively impact communities. Support each other and in fact just all of those who need support in order to help stronger, more strongly develop our communities. I will definitely take this on to my internship in Chicago to learn and grow more. Engagement to bring back to my community um, to help us with awareness uh, for social justice and help leaders in my community, API leaders. It's an internship program is to really build a stronger network with um, senators and public officials and with my fellow interns from all across the country as well. I think we have to come together and organize and find ways where we can fit in in different ways where we can act um, together. I think it's time for the API community to come together and rise to the occasion of leadership and become more engaged in the community. Well, every place is different and you know what works in your place. In some place you go, hey, this is Albany. 
right? And we're completely different from you. Go big. Sandy Chow, the greatest man. <laughs> Great organized events and you know lots of good information and we'll fly together moving forward. I'm encouraged. Thank you all. I'm very much impressed uh, with the energy and the passion in this room. Uh, I learned a lot. Thank you, CEO USA, and everyone. Thank you. CEO USA is awesome. Let's fly together. <laughs> Thank you, CEO USA. I had a lot of fun. Yeah, let's have more fun and do more things, great things. Uh, I think this is a great learning opportunity for me. So, thank you. Be charged. Together we are better. Building on new relationships. <clears throat> uh, great connections. Uh, very organized and among a lot. I would say empowering. Great. <clears throat> Future. Oh, wow. Great. Uh, a renewed sense of community. Great. Good information. It touches my heart to just hear all the comments. Too.